Well, hey, what's up, guys? This is Pamu9, and I'm starting a new sem segment I like to call Magic Card Tricks. I just what? started getting into Magic Card Tricks. I've been learning from YouTube, and now I'm passing it on to you from my channel. Why did you call it Pebble 9 Because that's my channel. And so, I know it can be easier to copy it and paste it from other channels. But I'm going to show you how to do it. Okay? So, at first I'm going to show you the trick. And then I'm going to show you a tutorial on how to do the trick. And hopefully some of you will subscribe to me. Think that's cool. And I will continue to learn these tricks. And show them to you. Okay. So, the first thing, since I don't currently have a uh, partner right now, so I'm just going to do... Uh, hey, I'm right here. Okay, shut up. So, I'm gonna, just going to do this simple prediction trick that I learned off of YouTube. So, what you want to do, uh, what I'm going to do is going to show you that all these cards are not magical at all. Okay? Ooh. These are not magical cards. They're not made for any specific purpose. purpose. So, I'm going to do this prediction trick, okay? So, I'm going to predict that this card, when this is all over with and everything, that this is, one card is going to be a queen and one card is going to be a diamond. Okay? So, uh, usually it's 3 to 50, they choose the deal out, so they say 20. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Put the rest of the deck away. And then you separate it in, er, I'm going to separate it into equal piles. Keep it stuck. I like number one. Okay. Okay, so we've almost got that done. Now watch this. You got your diamond, seven of diamonds, so that's the diamond part of the queen. And you got the queen of clubs, which is the queen. Now you're probably wondering, wow, how does she do this? This must be rigged at all. Um, I wouldn't say it's rigged. I didn't do anything beforehand. I just simply shuffled, as you saw me doing in earlier. I was just simply shuffling. So here's a tutorial on how you do it. Pretend you show this trick to many people or many times to one person, right? So you just keep saying, pretend that I've never seen, shown this to you or they'll start to figure it out. So once you do, you keep showing them that they're not magical cards. But the first two cards, um, they're, they're, there's the, that's the reason why I can predict a card, okay? So, but if it's like two, like a nine of clubs and a seven of clubs, which it's not, you just have to shuffle again, okay? So I'm going to try to find the uh, nine of hearts. Just keep showing them, you know, these cards aren't magical at all. You just keep trying to find the nine of hearts. What's up, players? Okay, so you just keep doing that. You just say, I'm going to predict that card. And one card's going to be a heart and one card's going to be a nine. So you just say 3 to 50, and you say 10 this time. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Realize that the card you're predicting, the two cards are on the bottom. Now, when you say you're going to put them to piles, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Do it like that. And they come to the top. So, that is my first card trick. I'll show you more soon. Oh, this is Tomo09, and I'm signing out. Goodbye.